The Malamata Market in Accra is an important trading center for especially market mummies across the country. The market offers a wide range of products ranging from foodstuffs to kitchenware, stationery and sanitary wear. But on a daily basis, these market mummies who call this place their office are faced with a number of challenges. Markets are important in the economy of every country, Ghana included. With a population of over 24 million people, markets provide the needs of the people as a place of business employing a large number of traders, storekeepers, hawkers, truck pushers and female headquarters locally called Kayaye. The Malamata Market, popularly called Malata Market, is one of the oldest and busiest markets in the city of Accra. It attracts business from all over the country and shoppers, especially those living in and around Kokomlemle, Accra New Town, Pig Farm and Roman Ridge. But on a daily basis, these market women who call this place their office are faced with a number of challenges. The first of it being the lack of a proper road network in the market. The women complain that whenever it rains, the whole market becomes muddy and some parts even get flooded. Like most markets in the country, Malamata Market has its fair share of sanitation issues. The situation is especially bad given that some traders display some of their produce on the floor. We caught up with Kwame Bwachi who does his bit by picking up the garbage in his truck alongside pills for his livestock. <laughs> He also pleaded with the authorities to provide a solution to the sanitation situation in the market. Upon entering the Malamata market, one thing is clearly noticeable. Most of the stalls constructed for the market women by the city authority are empty. According to the women, this is so because the design of the market makes it difficult for shoppers to come in without it getting congested. Just so that they can get a share of the market, most of the traders have moved outside the market to join their colleagues who are selling on the pavement. Some of the traders have also converted their designated stalls as a place to keep their wares and rather go through the market hawking their wares. This leads to further congestion in the market. A common issue that faces most Ghanaian markets is the problem of market fires. The causes of these fires are varied. They range from illegal or old electrical wiring to coal pot fires from cooking in the market. The Malamata market has escaped fires in recent times, but it is not wrong to say that the danger of fire looms closely. This is because of the close nature of the stalls and the haphazard nature of the sheds that the market women have put up themselves. Numa Blafo is the public relations officer of the AMA and this is what he had to say about the conditions of the market. The stores are owned by these um, traders and they rather prefer to trade on the aspects of the market than being in the market itself or being at their stores with the simple reason that by all means, there are people or when traders and shoppers are coming in, they will meet certain traders before meeting them and therefore, if what the person is coming to buy, the person finds it maybe at the gate or at the entrance, the person will not see what they are selling. So most of them just sell around the market and they use their stores as um, warehouses. They keep their wares in them. Also, there are no fire hydrants in the market, which will make it difficult to fight fires in case one should break out. We're looking at the structures, which we are very afraid of that. If in case there should be a fire outbreak, it might cause a lot of problems. That is why 
we are also trying to beat time to do the rebuilding. So we pray and hoping that that um, unfortunate incident will not happen at that place. He said the market has been slated for restructuring and renovation. We've already finished with the design and all that. So that's why maybe you will see it in this state as at the moment. For now, the market women will have to trade under the prevailing conditions and pray that the rains do not come soon, or better still, that there is no fire outbreak.